tipped just wide of the net by Dennis Peterson. And here you go, Dean Chenault and Randy McKay, Dennis Peterson, locking horns with Jeff Rogers. Rogers back to his feet. Peluso tries to dive in. Linesman saved him a third man in penalty. He's tried twice to get in. Now Lyle Odeline squares off with Troy Millett. At the moment, we've got three, now four separate battles as Peluso starts punching Trent McCleary. That's a very dangerous situation. Trent McCleary's got the eye problem. And, and look at Peluso. Peluso takes his helmet right off. He rips the helmet off. McCleary put his hands up. Give Peluso credit. He stopped immediately. Now that's Odeline and Millette to your left. Now everybody's squared off. Dean Chenault and Randy McKay at center ice. Odeline and Millette in front of the net. Chenault and McKay, the heavyweight battle right now. Dean Chenault's coming back from that abdominal injury. Boy, I'll tell you what, nothing's going to put more stress on that injury than a fight like that. You could feel it coming. I mentioned you could see all those guys out on the ice, and you just knew something was going to break out. They have broken them all up now. There are sticks and gloves everywhere. That's Trent McCleary, who's been under strict doctor's orders not to fight because of the eye injury. Peluso started pounding on him with the face shield on. Peluso then reached to the back of his helmet, pulled the helmet off. McCleary put up both hands. I don't know if he said anything or not. And Peluso stopped and didn't throw another punch. Well, I wonder if I've got another pen available here. We'll come back in just a moment. Bruins leading the Devils 3 to nothing. Now we told you, McCleary's been told by doctors he can't fight because of an eye injury. Now watch Peluso. Rips the helmet off. Watch McCleary. Wait, wait, and Peluso holds it right there and doesn't throw it. You gotta wonder if McCleary said something and Peluso held it up. Well, it was a drastic mismatch. Days of Boston Bruins hockey. Now count the pairs. Two down in the corner. Two more in the face-off circle. You actually see three down in the corner. You actually see five pairs of players all paired off. That's a scary situation, too, because uh, you're just one-on-one -on -one out there. And a scramble at the net mouth and a stoppage of play. Oh, it looked like the net was wide open. Now we have Peterson locked up in a scuffle with one of the Bruins, and it is Jeff Rogers. Well, Dennis is in with a full-time bona fide heavyweight. We talked about experience earlier. Dennis is giving up a lot to this guy. Now Mike Peluso is involved along the circle, you see, and is throwing some punches at Trent McCleary. McCleary back up, and Peluso coming through with some lefts on McCleary. Now he has the helmet off. It is not often you see this, but there are three scraps going on at once. Niedermeyer is wrestling around with a man. Odeline also scrapping with Troy Millette. So we really have had four fights. Now some hard lefts being thrown by Dean Chanel. He and Randy McKay are dueling right at center ice. In the meantime, Odeline coming through with some tremendous roundhouse rights on Troy Millette, and they have him down. You see this one, Chanel and McKay. The Millette Odeline fight is pretty much over. Just not enough, enough linemen out, linesmen out there right now to, to break up three fights at one time. Actually, all five players who matched up had a little tussle. Chanel playing his first game at surgery. He's that tough, strong type defensive player who likes to mix it up. And if this place was a little flat moments ago, it's buzzing right now. Can't hurt the Devils. The Devils were 
little lethargic and sometimes